Biting down with about 350 pounds per square inch of pressure. You guys must not be numbers people. I didn't get a reaction from that. All right. So I will Bob Ross you a picture right now. All right. If you were to raise up your refrigerator six inches off the ground, line it in 80 alligator teeth, and slam it down on your hand, that's what it's going to feel like to be bitten by the smallest alligator we have here in the pond. If you guys ever look at the yearling tank over there, those guys are a year old, they look cute and cuddly. They're already biting down with over a pit bull strength. Fully grown, these gators can get up to 13 to 16 feet long and have bite pressures of 20. You guys are leaving us soon. This is your time to get all the energy out, guys. Let them loose. All right, let your kids go crazy. Let them scream. I'm going to count to three. On three, you're going to scream as loud as you can if you want to come down here with me. One, two, three! That was a good warm up. Even better. I guarantee your mom knows what liability means. So, mom, teach her that word by the end of the day. She's going to need it, okay? All right, Bella. Now, there are three things absolutely necessary for a perfect alligator show, okay? It's an alligator. We need a handler. That's me. Now, I need an assistant. Brady. B A I T. Okay? You need to learn to spell too, Bella. Now, Bella, in order to be my assistant, you gotta look like me, okay? I got a uniform for you right here. Now, it's a little dirty, it's a little torn. Sit right here. You can wait there, Bella. <laughs> All right, Bella. Now, you picked an alligator over there, right? What do I have in front of me, Bella? A bunch of them. Like five feet alligators, right? So, here's what we're gonna do. I am going to go get that alligator that you picked over there on the top. But in order to do that, I'm going to have to get around these guys. So what you're going to do is take this stick, jump over those alligators right there, and splash. And then they're going to come to you. All right? You distract them. And then I'm going to go get that alligator over there so these guys don't bother. Sound good? <laughs> she needs some encouragement, guys. Let's give it up. Bella, 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 Bella. What do you... These people are not your friends. <laughs> Bella, there's no way I'm gonna go. You do need to learn liability, Bella. All right, stand back up there. I don't wanna lose my job, Bella, again. All right, Bella, I'm not gonna have you do that. All right, so you've got a lot of growing to do. Can you say hi? Say hi, Bella. There you go, absolutely. Now, Rocky's gonna be our show alligator for us. Now, Bella. Alligator. Look at your mom, let her get her picture. Now spin around because everybody wants to see your assistant shirt. Absolutely. Now turn around right here. All right. Now, Bella, have you ever seen The Lion King? Yep. My favorite movie. We're going to recreate my favorite scene, guys. All right. Raise up the alligator. He wouldn't make it in a while. Okay. Other animals at the same time. Okay. Okay. Albino of most species get killed because they can't blend into the environment. What does that feel like, Bella? Imagine him in a snow. Like rubber. Doesn't feel real, does it? It's not it all. It's the perfect no, point no, no. On the event that he was to come out of my arms, untaped, and he's out here untaped, what are you going to do? Zigzag right there, okay? Just zigzag, distract the gator, and I will go get help. No big deal. All right, Bella. Now, guys, we are going to be dealing with an untaped alligator here, so cell phones can't be out. All right? But you guys do need to remain quiet because unintended alligator is going to